Uh, hey guys, Jagofano123 back again with a video finally. It's been since before Christmas, I know, that went for sure, since I've made a video. So, yeah, I guess new stuff. I got braces. Fun, fun. Um, I got a baby brother. My stepmom had a kid, which is always fun. I, let's see, I got Black Ops 2, and I've been playing that. Still, you know, actually, you already know about that. I posted a gameplay. Um, I got my ears pierced, which are fun, fun. That's it, really. And but today, I have an unboxing and review for you. Um, I got my package from Illusions today. I ordered it Thursday, I think, last Thursday, and today's Monday. So, since they don't ship on Sunday or anything, it's really been two days for shipping, which is awesome. Illusionist always has great shipping. But, yeah, I already know what's inside, but, and if you can't tell it from the title, it's the blue LTD deck that I got. But, yeah, um, let's just pop this open and get into it. And of course, there goes my phone. Alright, so there's nothing left. And then, here's my invoice, and that's all it came with it. I'm surprised there's nothing else with it. Normally, they send out other things. But here it is the blue LTD deck. So, for a review of the box, it looks awesome. Um, if you guys aren't familiar with my channel, I'd and you haven't seen my videos before, I do not have the red LTD. So, this is a new experience for me in every way. But, so basically going over the box, on the front, it says, sorry about the glare, but it says LTD on the front, and it's like this bright blue color. It says LTD on the front in the circle, and there's, the top half is a lighter blue, and the bottom half is like the darker blue with the paisley design in the middle, and it just says LTD. Um, one side is blank, the other side is blank, the top is blank, the bottom just has distribution info about illusionists and stuff, and the back is blank, which is interesting. So it's a complete mystery. But then, I know what is different, even though I don't have the red LTD, I still know it's different, is they have a seal on this one. And if you can tell, if my iPod will adjust, come on, you can do it, adjust. It's not gonna focus, but it says um, it says LTD, just in a pattern. You can't read that at all, but it's just a dark blue seal that says LTD on it. And yeah, so far it all looks good, I guess. Um, so let's just pop this baby open and check it out. Actually, this is gonna... I'm not going to bother to keep the cello on because the box isn't, like, super exciting. There's no details to really mess up, and I'm, I know I'm going to take good care of this deck anyways. So, pop that off. The seal open. Alright, so now we popped open the seal. The flaps don't have anything on them. Just blank. And now for the deck. Alright, so I got the deck out, and wow. It looks awesome. Alright, so extra cards you get are these two. So you get a one of the new ad cards for your, for more unique playing cards, visit illusions.com. Um and you get a gaff of from the original LTD deck. That's a Queen of Hearts with the red back. So I guess if you just want to do like a Erdnase or something. But yeah, 
So, those are your extra cards. And now on to the Jokers. The Jokers smell like ink. Um, it smells very inky. But the Jokers are the same as the original, um, where they have the hand, which is controlling the, jo the J, uh, like the uh, puppet. And if you can tell, the dot for the J's are blue, and then on the bottom, the Joker, the J is blue, and Joker. But so, pretty cool. There are definitely no, no Jokers I've ever seen before. And into the back design, I haven't gotten there yet. And same as the normal LTD, except it's got blue dots instead of red ones. Let me grab the gaff card that came with it. So you can tell, it's just this sort of, just this pattern. Just like little, sort of bubbly diamonds. With the little diamonds in the middle of the blue diamonds. And it doesn't just shadow around the outside. And big thick white borders. But yeah. So the back design is cool, I like it. And now on to the rest of the look of the deck. Um, hmm. The rest of the deck is the same as the normal LTD, I know. But the Ace of Spades is the LTD. Ace of Spades is just the Ace of Spades, I guess. Pretty cool and simple. And it says limited at the bottom. And if you can tell, the pips are um, gray. And that's the cool part about this deck, is that all of the pips are gray, instead of black. And now, the court cards, move on to the court cards. Okay. Um, they are the same as the normal LTDs, I'm pretty sure. There's no different colors in here, it's not blue or anything, they're just the red, with the gray pips, still. Which, I'm, it's kind of disappointing. But they don't incorporate the blue anymore, but I mean, you can't ask for too much, can you? And then the rest of the cards are the same as they should be. You know, just the dark red and the gray again in red. Um, the deck looks really good so far, though. And if you couldn't tell, the pips are the same as they're the skinny ones from the Artifice decks. But now, as everybody watches these reviews for, once again, to the handling. The handling, um, the fans are amazing. Perfect fans. Like, that's just incredible. They don't look very good because of the thick white borders, so there's not much to see there. Sorry, I can't get the angle with the way my iPod's set up. But, um, they just, they feel really, really nice. They're really smooth and awesome. Um, but yeah, so fans are awesome. Every time a great fan. The dribbles are great. They're amazing. They're perfect. I love the dribbling this deck. I don't know what kind of stock they use. I'm pretty sure it's Aristocrat. But I'm not sure, but it's amazing. The springs are awesome. The stock is soft enough where you can get a good spring really, really easy. Which is really fun. It's this deck is highly enjoyable and stuff. And it just is really smooth. Let's check out a spread real quick if I can get one on the smooth surface. It if you can see that it spreads really nicely. I shouldn't I mean I did a bad spread. But still it's really smooth and just spreads evenly and nice and easy. Which is nice. It's just overall a very enjoyable deck. I really like this deck. So ratings, um, overall look of the deck and everything, I would have to give maybe in a good seven and a half, maybe eight. Yeah, a good eight out of ten. Because the only downfall for this deck is that. For the court cards, they didn't incorporate the blue in there, they just left it as the red, which I think is just kind of taking a shortcut. It's like, you could have made it a little more exciting. Um, that, uh, and just how they just, um, and the thick white borders are definitely part of it. How you can't get anything special in 
the fans. It's just white. But um, then handling of the deck, I would give a, um, a perfect 10 out of 10. It's great. The stock is amazing. The finish is amazing. I love this deck. I wish I had gotten two of them so I could actually use it, because I'm going to probably be too afraid to use it, but that comes with the nature of me, I guess. But yeah, so appearance is alright, handling is awesome, and overall, like, just shipping and service and everything, I mean, two days to get a deck is incredible, it's awesome. Um, but yeah, so overall, this deck I would give, just average it out, I would give it a good 9 out of 10. It's definitely up there. It's a good deck. Um, I enjoy it a lot. And um, I am not going to be having these long silences too often anymore, by the way. Um, just, I know I ordered last night. I got, since Dan and Dave have come out with the individually sold Smoke and Mirrors, I got all of them. I got one of all of them and an extra red because if you guys don't know already, the red ones are my favorite deck of all time. But, um, yeah, so I'll have those on my way in a couple weeks when they ship. Um, but yeah, so I will have another review up for you guys soon. Hopefully I'll have more videos out just in general, just updates and whatnot. But yeah, that's it for the, L the blue LTD deck. I love it. It is sexy, just like me. Um, but yeah, I will talk to you guys later.